Good morning, Grade 5. Welcome back to Grade 5 Mathematics class. How are you all doing today? Today, let's learn about temperature. So, what do you mean by temperature? We can say temperature is the degree of hotness or coldness of something. Or you can say temperature is a measurement of how hot or cold a place or an object is. Now, how do we measure temperature? Temperature can be measured using a device called a thermometer. And in your textbook, please turn to page number 175. Do you see the picture of a thermometer there? So you can see two scales are there on a thermometer. So it has got a Celsius scale and a Fahrenheit scale. And the Celsius scale is represented by a small circle written at the top followed by a capital C. And Fahrenheit scale is represented by a small circle at the top followed by the capital letter F. So here you can see the two most commonly used types of thermometers. So the first one is called an analog thermometer which uses mercury which is an element which gets heated up with a rise in temperature. And this is a digital thermometer from which you can directly read the temperature on the press of a button. So what is the unit of temperature? In what unit do we measure temperature? See the basic unit of temperature is degree but the standard unit is degree Celsius or centigrade. Now in the Celsius scale the temperature is marked from 0 degree to 100 degree on a thermometer. So water freezes at 0 degree Celsius and hence 0 degree Celsius is the freezing point of water according to the Celsius scale and water boils at 100 degree Celsius and hence 100 degree Celsius is the boiling point of water according to Celsius scale. Now what about Fahrenheit scale? In Fahrenheit scale the freezing point of water is equal to 32 degree Fahrenheit and the boiling point of water is equal to 212 degree Fahrenheit. So when you compare the Celsius scale and the Fahrenheit scale, you see that 0 degree Celsius is equal to 32 degree Fahrenheit and 100 degree Celsius is equal to 212 degree Fahrenheit. Now how do we convert a temperature in one scale to a temperature in the other scale? See look at this picture here, you can see a thermometer here and there is the Celsius scale and the Fahrenheit scale. When you observe this carefully, you can see that on the two scales, the scales start at a different number. On the Celsius scale, the scale starts at 0 degree Celsius, but on the Fahrenheit scale, the scale starts at 32 degree Fahrenheit. So when you convert from degree Celsius to degree in Fahrenheit, what would you have to do? You may have to add 32 degree to get the temperature in the Fahrenheit scale. For example, 0 degree Celsius is equal to 0 plus 32 or 32 degree Fahrenheit. And you also see that on the scales, the temperatures rise at a different rate. On the Celsius scale, the temperature ranges from 0 degree to 100 degree Celsius, whereas on the Fahrenheit scale, the temperature ranges from 32 degree Fahrenheit to 212 degree Fahrenheit which has the difference of 180 degree Fahrenheit. So here on the Celsius scale the difference between the lowest range and the highest range is 100 degree whereas in the Fahrenheit scale the difference between the lowest range and highest range of temperature is 180 degree. So when you convert from Celsius to Fahrenheit or Fahrenheit to Celsius you have to multiply the temperature, the given temperature by a factor of either 180 by 100 or 100 by 180 accordingly. See, these are fractions and you can reduce these fractions to its lowest term. So, I'm going to divide both the numerator and denominator by 20 which gives me 9 by 5 and here it will be 5 by 9. So when you do conversions from one scale to the other, you'll have to either add or subtract the number 32 and also multiply it by 9 by 5 or 5 by 9 accordingly. 
this will be more clear to you when you do examples of conversion. So, to convert a temperature from Celsius scale into Fahrenheit scale, you have to multiply the temperature by 9 by 5 and then add 32 to it. So, we can express this using the formula degree Fahrenheit is equal to First, you have to multiply the given temperature in Celsius by 9 by 5, then add 32 to it. So, by formula, it is degree Fahrenheit is equal to degree Celsius into 9 by 5, the whole thing, plus 32. You may note down this formula in your notebook and learn it by heart. Now, we'll do one question. Temperature of a hot glass of milk is 65 degrees Celsius. Convert this temperature into Fahrenheit scale. So, by formula, how do we convert from Fahrenheit to Celsius? Degree Fahrenheit is equal to degree Celsius, the given temperature in Celsius, into 9 by 5 and that plus 32. So, what is our given temperature in terms of Celsius? We are given 65 degree Celsius. So, let's say that into Fahrenheit scale but after writing proper steps. So, the temperature in Celsius scale is equal to 65 degrees Celsius and the temperature in Fahrenheit scale is equal to, make sure that you write the formula first, degree Celsius into 9 by 5 plus 32. So, substituting the given temperature there, that is equal to 65 into 9 by 5 plus 32. First, we have to do the calculation within the brackets. So, 65 into 9 by 5. See? Cutting out the common factors, dividing both 65 and 5 by a factor of 5, we get 65 divided by 5 is equal to 13, 5 divided by 5 equals 1. So, that is equal to 13 into 9 by 1, which is equal to 13 into 9 itself plus 32. And 13 into 9 equals 117 plus 32 gives you 149 degree Fahrenheit, which is the equivalent temperature of 65 degrees Celsius in the Fahrenheit scale. So now let's see how we can convert from Fahrenheit scale to Celsius scale. To convert a temperature from Fahrenheit scale into Celsius scale, first subtract 32 from the temperature and then multiply by 5 by 9. So by formula it is degree Celsius is equal to the degree Fahrenheit, the given temperature to us, degree Fahrenheit minus 32 into 5 by 9. So, let's make it more clear with our example. Here we have a question, convert 130 degree Fahrenheit into Celsius scale. Let's see the steps. The temperature in Fahrenheit scale given to us, it is equal to 130 degree Fahrenheit and the temperature in Celsius scale is equal to, first make sure that you write the formula, degree Fahrenheit minus 32 into 5 by 9. So, substituting the temperature in the Fahrenheit scale, we have 113, which is in the question, minus 32 into 5 by 9. So, do the calculation given within the brackets first. So, 113 minus 32 is equal to 81, 81 into this 5 by 9. So, cancelling out the common factors. 81 divided by 9 is equal to 9 and 9 divided by 9 is equal to 1. So, this part is equal to 9 into 5 by 1 which is equal to 9 into 5 itself and that is equal to 45 degree Celsius which is the equivalent temperature of 130 degree Fahrenheit in the Celsius scale. So, I hope this question is clear to you. Now, children you can go to these topics from page number 174 to 176 of your textbook then you have to move on to exercise 11.4 and do all the questions from 11.4 in your notebook and there is also a maths lab activity given in the same page please go through that as well and do accordingly so that's all for today children we'll meet in the next class till then bye